so hey guys and welcome to my channel my name is Angel Clary and I welcome you all to this wonderful family that I call the antique squad hey guys hey guys don't forget to hit the subscribe button the notification bell don't forget to also like okay it's important today i am going to be reviewing first time impressions of the wet and wild photo focus foundation um i don't know the shade but it looked a bit like me when i bought it there were a lot of like caramel shades that were a little bit darker i do feel like i've um changed my color i feel like i went a little bit more light so you can see the difference here this one is the fit me and it's in the shade 330 which is toffee and this is the one that i usually use my day one of course but today we're going to be using this one and how i came about to buy this product um that shop that i don't like that blue and white shop decided to lure me into their shop by having a sale of three for two buy 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 two get one free i don't know get the cheapest one free i think that's what it's say yeah so i was like mm, you know what swallow your pride baby girl hub yoga click so i went and i got those three products over here i got the highlighter concealer and the foundation they're all wet and wild so yeah let's get straight into this video okay so guys i am going to be doing this i hope i put it here this kylie look which is going to be a little bit of a troublesome thing to do because i have this um yusha's cosmetics pencil it's pink i hope you guys can see it it's pink but i'm not sure if it will last then i will have if it doesn't i will have to use my palette to try and do it um I'm gonna clip this hair back because I feel like a foundation is a very shallow and it won't be cute. So I'm gonna use my clips and I'm gonna clip my hair back. So I don't have, um, what is it called? I don't have a primer <laughs> i don't have a primer right now so i am going to use my poshia m marula oil serum this over here i'm going to use it as my primer i already did my eyebrows so i hope that's not that doesn't get me into trouble because i still not learned how to do my eyebrows on camera even though i did on my previous video but that was just like a challenge and they didn't come out the way the these ones have and i hope i'm not messing them up you know what let me just go and get a mirror which is why you have to collect your things before you start a video so i'm just gonna go and get my mirror and come back but they there was like a little bit of 
something that moved <laughs> something that moved so i'm just gonna fix that yeah hydrate guys don't forget to hydrate drink water just kidding so now we're going to use the foundation and all my life i've always applied foundation like so you saw my previous video or you've seen in my previous videos i've always done that of which i'm not going to do that today i'm going to put it in this foundation brush what i don't like first impressions right this is how it looks nee? Uh, they say it hydrates, it smoothens complexion in a great finish, normal to dry skin, shake well before use. Okay. Um, what I don't like is that they say it's matte. When I checked online, they say it's matte, of which I, I don't think so. Hydrating things are normally not matte so we're gonna see another thing i like it when a foundation you can squeeze or you can just pump just like this thing that i just use when you just like can pump it up this one has this thing i don't know what it's called but i don't like it that's one thing that I don't like that's another thing that I don't like about it but let's hope we do a great job okay so this is what we are going to do I okay I think I overdid it I do have a heavy hand when it comes to makeup products. <laughs> I look so stupid. But anything is fixable when you have a beauty blender. brush thing is not working and it's not for me to use so I'm just gonna blend everything out okay just it as it is um it's not full coverage i will say that it hasn't covered everything it covers some things but not everything maybe if I, I would go in but I don't feel like going in and with the second layer because um, it you saw how much I put in so yeah if you don't want a foundation that won't cover everything then don't go for it that's my first impressions i don't know how it will go during the day but for now no it's not full coverage and then next we highlight this is their photo focus same thing photo photo focus concealer contour correct yeah correct yeah wet and wild photo focus yeah so we're gonna go in with that and we're gonna highlight here I don't want to put in so much highlighter because I feel like the foundation is already lighter than my skin. So I'm only putting it on the 
beads and pots just in small portions yeah I think that's fine and then we're gonna blend that out with the beauty blender I like its texture more than the foundation that's what I'm going to say I like the concealer more than the foundation sorry guys for the noise there's some people passing by and you gotta just wait for them okay so now we are going to contour everything using my slick makeup pro console um to like this this is it and that's what we're using this part is not part of the video so i don't feel like i okay i should explain it My signatures translucent powder and very affordable <laughs> I think it's even less than 100 grams and I'm going to use this little brush over here to just put it on all the places that have um, the lighter concealer This step I am doing because I know it's something that Kylie does so that's why I'm doing this one step and then the nose yeah and then after that we go into the eye in the eye why did i say i <laughs> maybe i'm getting married <laughs> um i have my golf golf flower i think palette over here and kylie had yellow in her eyes so that's what i'm going to do take this brush over here and we're just going to go to this um, yellow color over here and then we go to town I guess it's not that pigmented so Okay, so guys, I did go on and do um, the pink with uh, with this shade, both shades, both these shades, this pink one, this one, and this one, um, and I think it looks pretty good, I hope, and then now we're gonna just... Um, Remove all the powder. Okay. 
I think that looks pretty good and then now I'm gonna go in with my powder that looks like me from Mel's and just apply that over everything because I look a bit ashy child <laughs> I look at the ashy. I really tried, guys, with the eyeshadow and whatever, whatever. I really tried. It was really difficult. So that's why I had to go off camera. But the end result was good. And then now let's just set everything up before the highlighter um what is this thing called blush and everything let's just set this what i've done now and then we'll set again so now i'm just gonna put in um my mascara for the lashes if i will be able to with them on because it is still a struggle in CBT struggle <laughs> mm -hmm. I really love this mascara it's also from signature Ooh, child. let me fix that <laughs> Okay guys, I think that's okay for now and then I'm gonna go in with my blush and just blush up my face not too much because I'm thinking about pink but Kylie is pink in that video so I might as well just go over but a little not too much <laughs> that's too pink that's definitely too pink but it's fine I'm gonna go in with a blush so that it can hi hide all this this blush is also from wet and wild I mean highlighter <laughs> Highlighter is also from Wet and Wild, so yeah. And then we're gonna masquerade for the second time because I don't want to do my lashes. There's a lot of things that went wrong in this video, so eyelashes should just not be in that mix. I hate doing this beauty mark okay, because I feel like the ends are not good but I'm not sure because I kind of want to do it I think that's fine <laughs> I think that's fine and I believe that is the look that Kylie made on her face I tried I really did a lot of complications with the foundation okay first of all this video was a total mess if you ask me um i think i did pretty good with the look considering i have no experience in makeup i hope you guys like my barn can you see it i don't think you can you guys can see a little bit of it now but yeah Overall, 
the foundation. Oh my gosh. What can I say that is good about it? First of all, I have a very, 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 very oily skin. And it says, what is that part? Normal to dry skin. It's not normal. It's hydrating, sure, that's a plus. It is hydrating. It is um, not matte. It's not matte, of which I would have loved it to be matte. It's not full coverage. I don't mind that because also this one is not full coverage. That the one the one I use is not full coverage, and I like that. Um, what else? Sue's complexion no mm -mm. guys i went to clicks the shop that i don't like and bought this and it was the only shade that was closer to me and i don't remember how many shades they had they said they had but like it was the only shade close to me and when i got here and did it it was very light i don't want to lie but overall the only thing that i liked about these three products that i bought let me just review all three of them i like this it's really nice i think this is my first time having like an original brand like highlighter and i really like it and then uh, this i love the texture is wonderful the color it's a little bit light and i bought this light one because of this see this combo i was like this is the winner i look like this and then when i got here no but this I would recommend to someone who has um, dry skin. I would recommend it to someone who has dry skin and try to portion yourself. Don't put too much and just a little bit, a little bit. Don't overdo it, don't go overboard and you'll be fine. I hope you guys enjoy this mess of a video because it is really a mess and I needed to shoot something and just to be consistent man just to be consistent and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed it I love you all so very much I thank you for the support and uh, let's keep growing I love you all my active squad if you haven't yet subscribed hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet liked like if you haven't yet commented just say hi and yeah goodbye guys